We present here a Lipostem Duo treatment on a 75-year-old female patient with 4th degree osteoarthritis of the left knee. The patient had undergone surgery three years ago for a medial unicompartmental knee arthroplasty on the opposite knee. She began experiencing discomfort in this knee around the middle of last year, especially on the medial side. X-rays and MRI scans revealed significant cartilage erosion, affecting her daily activities with knee pain and mobility issues. At this point, the patient, fully aware of the potential need for a medial unicompartmental knee arthroplasty, chose to undergo treatment with Lipostem Duo before considering surgical intervention, in order to improve her personal independence. To prepare the patient for further procedures, a mild anesthetic, lidocaine, is administered by the surgeon in the abdominal area. Two 60 ml syringes are filled with Klein solution and connected to the 60 ng cannula included in the kit. The surgeon makes a small incision in the patient's abdomen with a scalpel to prepare it for further procedures. Client solution is infiltrated into the patient's abdomen. Meanwhile, the medical assistant starts preparing the Lipostem Duo device. She first closes the T-tap of the waste bag. The infusion set line is unfolded to connect the Lipostem Duo to a physiological solution bag. One end of the infusion set line is connected to the wash-in valve, at the top left of the device. The clip on the infusion set line is opened, to enable the flow of saline. The line leading to the waste bag is closed. The other end of the infusion set line is connected to the stand and the Lipostem Duo is completely filled with physiological solution. Vac lock syringes for liposuction are prepared by connecting them to the 13G cannula provided in the kit. Once the client solution takes effect, Liposuction is performed by the surgeon in the patient's abdominal area. To perform liposuction, the surgeon makes fan-shaped movements on the patient's abdomen with the vaclox syringe under negative pressure. The first full syringe of fat, mixed with blood, oil and Klein solution, is extracted from the patient's abdomen. The surgeon extracts the second syringe of fat. The content of the two syringes of fat is injected into the lipo in valve, located in the upper part of the device. The technician makes sure that the upper clip of the infusion line and the clamp on the waste bag line are open, to ensure a continuous flow of saline solution. Spatula strokes facilitate washing, purification and micro-fragmentation through the device's double filtration system. With the washing, oil, blood, client solution and any other residues are collected in the waste bag. The first filter, 1000 microns, micro fragments the adipose tissue and the second filter, with a denser mesh, 51 microns, retains it while the saline solution washes out residues.
When adipose tissue turns yellow, the infusion line clip is closed to halt the flow of the physiological solution. A few more spatula strokes remove the excess saline solution. The 10 ml syringes, included in the kit, are used to extract the purified adipose tissue from the lipoat valve, located in the lower part of the device. Anesthetic is injected by the surgeon after inserting the 20G cannula included in the kit into the patient's knee. The syringe of processed, microfragmented fat is then connected to the 20G cannula in the patient's knee and the adipose tissue is injected. The treatment has been perfectly successful, and the patient hasn't experienced any issues. We performed an abdominal liposuction and the tissue was processed using the Lipostem Duo system to obtain a purified solution. This solution was smoothly introduced into the patient's knee using a 20G needle, without any complications. The patient is leaving the operating room in good condition, wearing an abdominal support belt as a preventive measure and with instructions to apply ice and take pain medication if needed.